Dr. William Davis here, author of The Wheat Belly and Undoctored Books. Why do many of us argue that we all need to address the T3 thyroid hormone? That is, when you have a thyroid assessment, a free T3 level is included in the lab work. And if you're low, one of the things to consider is to replace your T3 thyroid hormone. You can do that as uh, one of the com uh, combination preparations that contain both the T4 and the T3, like Armour Thyroid or Nature Thyroid. Or the liothyronin can be added to your levothyroxine. That is, the T3 tablet can be added to your T4. But what, why is this? And why do most endocrinologists say this is stupid, that there's no data to back this up? Well, what they're failing to do is examine the toxicological evidence. Not the endocrinological evidence, but the toxicological evidence. So the toxicology world has identified literally dozens of industrial compounds that block the body's conversion of T4 to the T3 thyroid hormone. In other words, T4 is not all that active. It has to be converted by an enzyme called 5' diiodinase. It removes one of the iodines to the T3. So that 4 and the 3 refer to the number of iodine molecules per thyroid hormone molecule. So T4 must be converted to T3 in the body for thyroid hormone to become active. But you and I are exposed to a C of industrial compounds, like the triclosan and hand sanitizer and antibacterial soaps, or the perfluorooctanoic acid that came from nonstick cookware, and dozens of others. And they block the conversion of T4 to T3. So it means that many people take, for instance, levothyroxine or Synthroid, yet they're still left with all the symptoms of hypothyroidism, all the phenomena of hypothyroidism. Fatigue, cold hands and feet, or being inappropriately cold, inability to lose weight, often gaining weight, increased heart disease risk, and other uh, phenomena. So the key here, we can't remove those compounds, unfortunately, no one has a detoxification process yet that allows us to remove those chemicals that are blocking our thyroid conversion. So right now, as of current knowledge, we, uh, when you have, a take, have to take thyroid hormone, you take T4 with T3, and about eight out of 10 people feel better. They get rid of all the cold feelings, the fatigue, the weight gain, and regain the ability to lose weight. So if you're gonna have thyroid examined, do it with someone who's open-minded, who's kept up with the science, showing that the toxicological exposures are blocking our conversion from T4 to T3. Replacing T3 is currently the best way to handle that.